Hello everybody, I'm BTV, you're watching Variety Television, and welcome back to Stardew Valley. My parsnips from the first day that I was here are finally ready, and by golly, I'm gonna pick them. I'm also gonna water the rest of my crops, they need to be watered. It's a good way to start the day by going through and watering everything. And the next thing I want to do is go by the, um, I want to go by the place that sells things, the store, the, like, general store, and I want to buy a lot more seeds and really expand this farming operation I have. I want, like, crazy, crazy money. The, um, the store has that backpack for 2400 and I want that. Okay, so everything is so, uh, uh, watered. Let's go check the mail, apparently. To our valued Jojamart customers, our team members have removed the landslide caused by our drilling operation near the mountain lake. I'd like to remind you that our drilling operation is entirely legal, pursuant to init L61091 Jojico Amendment, responsible Stewardship of the local environment is our top priority, I'm sure. We apologize for any inconvenience this accident may have caused, and as always, we value your continued support and patronage. Morris, JoJo Customer Satisfaction Representative. Yeah. Mmm. I don't believe that they truly have the environment in their utmost importance, put it that way. I also kind of want to talk to Lewis a bit because his birthday is coming up, right? And I don't, I don't know what Lewis likes, you know. So, what's this? Help wanted. Lewis is in need of largemouth bass. Huh. I'll accept it. I'll try and do it. I also, oh, I also have to find Marnie and 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 give her the seaweed that I have. So let's start by. Oh, uh, they're not open for another 40 minutes. Okay. This is actually okay because this will give us time. But don't you have work to do? Rude. Don't you have? Um. Anyway, let's see. Where could Marnie be? Looking for a person named Marnie. She's in need of seaweed and I have seaweed. Well, there's some, um, I'm gonna take these. Archeology span office, that sounds awesome. Um, Canther. Hello there, welcome to this Stardew Valley Archeolo- It belongs in a museum. Uh, the previous curator made off with the entire collection. We don't have any artifacts for display, but I'm hoping to remedy that soon. So if you find any artifacts or minerals out there, would you let me know? Okay, so this is like, um, I don't want to draw like too many comparisons, but this I, I assume would be like the Animal Crossing Museum situation. Uh, that's pretty cool. Tips on farming. Use fertilizer to improve quality, reduce workload, or hasten crop growth. Interesting. Fruit trees take a whole season to grow, but they require very little maintenance. Keep the area directly around your new sapling clear, or else it may not grow properly. Crops will die as soon as the season ends, unless they grow in multiple seasons. Example corn. Some crops, such as kale and wheat, need to be harvested with the scythe. Okay. Thank you, book. I did not know about fertilizer could potentially speed up the pace of our stuff. Shop. Oh, we can just buy some ore. We smelt it into bars, craft and smelting. Oh, okay. Used to break stones, 2,000 gold and requires five copper bars. And then I buy the copper ore from you and the stuff to make the copper bars. Okay, interesting. I'm wondering if it's possible to mine. 
metalworking blueprints. I bet it's possible to mine somewhere and get that stuff for yourself. Still on the lookout. Oh, there's a Jojo Mart here. What? Whoa. Okay, so they have a lot of stuff. Wallpaper flooring. Hmm, it's this guy. Interesting, interesting. Well, let's talk to this dude stocking. Shane's hard at work. He doesn't seem interested in talking. Oh, it's the... It's that Shane? Okay, wait then. Because if the people from the town work here... Who are you? You don't say. Okay. Is Shane the only one who works here? Is that why he was so grumpy and was all like, don't you get work to do earlier? Because in reality, he had work to do. Here. All right, well, bye. The old people lived there with that guy who tosses the football to himself. Where is Marnie, dude? All right, you know what? I don't know. I give up. Maybe we'll just run into her somewhere. Because I don't know. Where? I wish there was a way to, like... Is there a way to know where people are? And the map doesn't tell you. The map doesn't show people. Adventurer Guild. Mines! I knew there was a mine. Tent. Carpenter shop. Robin, Demetrius, Sebastian, Maru. Oh, it does tell you where certain people's houses are. I don't see Marnie listed as living anywhere. So... That was weird. Okay, so... Oh, 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 oh. Is this Lewis? I want to give him... A parsnip. No! No, I didn't want to... Okay. Okay, and now what if I check... Lewis. Okay. He likes parsnips. It's not his favorite gift, but he likes it. Is there a Marnie here within the hospital? Harvey. Okay. Be definitely incorporated into a healthy diet. Okay, nobody cares, dude. Five beans. I don't know where Marnie is, but. Oh. Well, that's rude. Uh huh. What's this neat looking place? Maybe Marnie is in here. She's. She wasn't. Ah, but there's mystery seeds. Hmm. Who are you? Maru, hey, sorry if I seem cranky. I'm a little sore from work yesterday. Sorry to hear that. Um, here. You're welcome. Next person I see, getting this last daffodil. Who's it gonna be? You. Sebastian, who's very confused about receiving this daffodil. Oh, you just moved in, right? Cool. Are you Marnie? No, that's Robin, or whatever. Um, Demetrius. Greetings, I'm Demetrius, local scientist and father. Thanks for introducing yourself. No problem, Demetrius. Uh, what's... 
Does Marnie live here? Mayhaps. What else do you sell? Construct farm buildings? A coop? Okay, so I can have this built with 4,000 gold, 300 wood, and 100 stone. Um, okay, I'm gonna leave that basement situation. Okay, so not exactly what I was looking for, I don't think. Oh, I just noticed where my energy gauge is on the bottom right. I have not until now seen that. This is suspicious. Is this the cave-in thing? Railroad. I bet that's the cave-in thing the people were the, the in that letter. Linus, a stranger. Hello. Hello, Linus. Would you mayhaps like a rock? Hmm, this doesn't really do much for me. Oh, I'm sorry, Linus. You look like a caveman, so I thought maybe you would enjoy a rock. Look, there's another one of these things. I don't know what they do, though. Can't interact with them at all. If anybody knows what those are, tell me. Is this the mine? Did I find it? Oh, look, it's a caveman. man. Marlin. Hmm. I was just peering down into this old mine shaft. It is the mine. It's been abandoned for decades. Cool, cool. Still, there's probably good ore down there. But a dark place, undisturbed for so long, I'm afraid ore isn't the only thing you'll find. Excuse me? Here, take this. You might need it. Whoa! There's combat in this game? A rusty sword? Name's Marlin, by the way. Run the Adventurer's Guild right outside. I'll keep my eye on you, prove yourself, and I might think about making you a member. Alright. Um. Out of order. Okay, well, I definitely want to check out this mining situation. But. Also, my inventory is pretty full, and it's 5 p.m., so. That's probably going to have to be for another day. Proven adventurers only. Only those he say he says is worthy. What is this? Some sort of ficus? <laughs> it's a wild horseradish. Alright, I'm just gonna walk home, I guess. I didn't find Marnie and I wasted a whole freaking day. Bought some beans and I don't know what a trellis is. I do actually have one last idea. Now that it's starting to get late. They said the saloon gets lively at night, so maybe most people come here. And it could be a place to find Marnie. Pierre. Elliot. Leah. It's simpler to be friends with the trees. They don't have much to say. Alright. Pam. Uh, that's Marnie. Okay, okay. Uh, Marnie, 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 Marnie. See you. Hey, you brought me the item I asked for. Thanks so much. Let's see here. Here's what I owe you. 60 gold. At least, that's what it said. I thought. Oh well, let's get out of here. Um. Let's go home. Because I finally was able to give Marnie the seaweed, which was what I set out to do the whole entire day so oh it automatically puts it uh, no tomorrow I'm going to the mine I'm watering all my crops and walking straight to the mine I want to see what's up with that that's very interesting to me all right uh we can craft a scarecrow. We can craft basic fertilizer because our farming leveled up. Uh, foraging has leveled up, so our axe proficiency went up. We can craft wild seeds and we can craft field snacks. Cool. Oh, explore the mine. Reach level five in the mines. Delivery. 
Oh, it's the final day to bring Lewis a, a largemouth bass or I'll fail the thing. Oh no. And I forgot to put all my stuff in the box. Dang it, dude. So there's probably no way in heck I'm catching a largemouth bass for Lewis today. God dang it. I might not even be able to catch that with the fishing pole I have. Like, I might need a better fishing pole than the one I even have to catch that. Or, I might need to fish in a whole different location. But hold on, there's some deep water right here. Like where, a, like where a large bass might live, so let's see. Got plenty of smallmouth bass, so maybe there's a chance that there's a large mouth one in here. Okay, got a new record on smallmouth, so that's good. Ah, green algae. Ah. No. Green algae again. Come on, I want to fish. A largemouth bass, to pre be precise. Yo, check it out. Green algae. Man, I'm not really sure what to do about this largemouth bass situation. If this is the last opportunity that I have, and I really want to finish the quest... What is that, Dan? Is that like a... What's that? A trilobite? You found an artifact. The curator of the local museum might want to know about this. Okay. Another one? Trilobite. Trilobite. Cool. I'll get all these trilobites, dude. Let me put these back so that it's not just tilled land also, because I don't very much care for that. Okay. The man's is not here. All right, let's go to the museum for now then. Ah. Oh, is it this place that I'm really literally standing right beside? Yes, okay. Abysmal. Not a single piece in the entire collection. Well, do I have a trilobite for you? What's this? You found something? Let me see it. Remarkable. It's very old. I'd love to study this in greater detail, but it is yours. Hmm. I've got a favor to ask. Would you consider donating any new artifacts or minerals that you find? We could make a groundbreaking discovery together. Oh, and who knows? If you keep donating, I might come across some interesting items to send your way. Look, I don't know about that, man, but I have a trilobite and I'll give it to you because I have multiple. And I wouldn't mind seeing this place all filled out. That's my cup of tea. Alright, Gunther. Donate to museum. One. One trilobite. Oh, I can pick where it goes. Well, I should go here for now, I guess. Did it place? A trilobite. Trilobite, a long extinct relative of the crab. Nice. Gunther! Did you see that trilobite, though? Lewis! I'm looking for your fish right now. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, it's not green algae. That's a good sign. It could be. Oh no. It could be. It could be. Largemouth bass. Come on. No. Not smallmouth. Green algae. My fishing is gonna go through the roof, dude. Alright, well now I have to go put stuff up because if I freaking fish anything else up, I won't have space for it. Anyway, let's get home. Let's put some of this stuff away. Maybe I can catch a largemouth bass in my thing. My own little pond here. Let's see. Any largemouth bass in here? Hmm. A soggy newspaper. Is that just trash or can I like read it? It's just trash. Can any fish be caught here? Or am I just wasting time? Driftwood. Okay. Do I have any other bodies of water? Bigger ones, mayhaps? Yes. Alright. This looks a little bit more promising. Okay, driftwood. Immediately. I'm starting to think there's no fish in these. Or I'm just getting really, really unlucky. Mm -hmm. Alright. Cool. I'm almost out of energy, though. So, should I just fish until I have no more I'll fish one more time here and if it's anything other than a fish then I'm going to a different body of water okay I forgot to water my crops oh no oh no that is not how you make them grow. I wonder how many times I've forgotten to water my crops. Let's put some of this stuff up. Let's go see what's up with this parson if I can't pick. Oh, what's so good about it? I don't know. Sorry, Lewis. I, I didn't catch your fish. If anybody has tips on catching specific fish, I would appreciate that. Oh, that's a lot of money. 1,044 gold. That's not bad at all. So, with that being said, that's gonna be the end of this one. So I really hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please consider leaving a like or subscribing. And... I hope to see you guys in the next episode of Stardew Valley, and until then, goodbye.